Mike Menser, a bodybuilding superstar, transformed the fitness industry with his high-intensity training, or HIT, concepts. He defied established bodybuilding thinking, pushing for shorter, more intensive sessions. Menser's technique emphasizes pushing muscles to their extreme limitations, causing considerable muscular gain and fat loss. Menser's own body served as a testimonial to his techniques. He acquired exceptional muscularity and definition, illustrating the benefits of HIT. His triumph at the 1979 Mr. Universe competition sealed his position in bodybuilding history. Menser's legacy stretches beyond medals and wins. He influenced other folks to take a better, more efficient approach to training. His lessons continue to resonate with fitness enthusiasts seeking best outcomes in little time. High-intensity training, or HIT, stands in sharp contrast to typical bodybuilding methods. It discards the concept of lengthy, drawn-out exercises, emphasizing quick, concentrated sessions. HIT emphasizes on quality over quantity, emphasizing effort within a restricted window. The underlying idea of HIT lies in straining muscles to total failure. This implies reaching a point where no additional repetitions can be accomplished with correct form. This degree of activity generates substantial physiological changes, leading to muscular development and fat reduction. HIT workouts often feature complex movements targeting many muscular groups simultaneously. Deadlifts and presses activate a higher amount of muscle mass, improving overall strength and growth. By eliminating rest intervals between sets, HIT enhances the metabolic load of the exercise. This heightened metabolic stress further leads to fat burning and muscle growth, making HIT a very effective training approach. It hits success originates from its ability to accelerate critical physiological processes that cause muscle building and fat reduction. By pushing muscles to their ultimate limits, HIT initiates muscle protein synthesis, the process by which your body repairs and produces new muscle tissue. Intense exercise also raises your metabolism both during and after your workout. This higher metabolic rate means your body burns more calories, even at rest, helping to fat reduction. HIIT also boosts the production of anabolic hormones such as testosterone and growth hormone, which further assist muscle building and fat burning. Moreover, HIIT enhances insulin sensitivity, enabling your body to use carbs more efficiently. This improved insulin sensitivity helps reduce fat accumulation and increases muscle glycogen replenishment, critical for muscular repair and development. By integrating HIIT concepts, you build an appropriate hormonal and metabolic environment for attaining your fitness objectives. HIT provides distinct benefits for both seasoned athletes and those new to weight training. For expert bodybuilders, HIT offers a technique to break past plateaus and drive new muscular development. By pushing beyond their comfort zones, skilled lifters may test their muscles in ways conventional techniques no longer can. Beginners benefit from HIT's simplicity and effectiveness by concentrating on compound exercises and perfect technique. Novices may acquire a good foundation in strength training. HIT lower training length also makes it a more accessible alternative for folks with hectic schedules. Regardless of your fitness level, HIT stresses perfect technique and increasing overload. This includes gradually increasing the weight, resistance, or intensity of your exercises over time. This stepwise technique promotes continued improvement and reduces the chance of damage. Despite its established efficacy, HIT is frequently surrounded by misunderstandings. One widespread fallacy is that HIT leads to overtraining. However, HIT stresses appropriate recovery, acknowledging its relevance in muscular building. By exercising less often, HIT offers adequate opportunity for your body to heal and rebuild muscular tissue. Another myth is that HIT is only appropriate for experienced trainers. In actuality, HIT concepts may be applied for any fitness level. Beginners may start with lesser weights and progressively increase intensity as they advance. The idea is to emphasize perfect form and listen to your body. Some people argue that HIIT exercises are too brief to be beneficial. However, the intensity of HIIT sessions compensates for their shortness. By exerting effort within a restricted time period, HIIT generates considerable physiological changes, leading to obvious outcomes. Intensity reigns supreme in the arena of HIIT. It's not about lazily going through the motions, but challenging your physical and mental limitations. Intensity controls the efficacy of your exercises and eventually decides your outcomes. To attain the appropriate degree of intensity, you must be prepared to accept suffering. This involves pushing each set to the point of temporary muscle failure, when you can no longer do another repetition with perfect form. However, energy should never come at the price of appropriate form. 
Maintaining perfect technique during each exercise is vital for minimizing injuries and ensuring that targeted muscles get the appropriate stimulation. Remember, intensity is related to your current fitness level. What defines high intensity for a novice will vary from that of an experienced lifter. The trick is to continuously push oneself and aim for increasing overload. In HIT, workout selection is about optimizing efficiency and efficacy. Compound workouts, which train many muscular groups simultaneously, take center stage. These actions, including a squats, deadlifts, rows, and presses, produce more muscular development and hormonal reaction compared to solitary workouts. Focus on executing each repeat with accuracy and control. Avoid speeding through the exercises or utilizing momentum to raise the weight. Instead, try for a controlled, eccentric, lowering phase and a forceful, concentric, lifting phase. Prioritize quality over quantity. It's best to accomplish a few flawless reps with a hard weight, then to forgo form for more repetitions with a smaller weight. Remember, intensity is crucial, and that means keeping perfect form throughout the whole set. Recovery is not only an afterthought and hit. It's an inherent component of the training concept. Muscles don't expand throughout your exercises. They increase throughout the recuperation phase, when your body heals and rebuilds injured muscle fibers. Adequate sleep is crucial for muscle healing and development. Aim for seven to nine hours of excellent sleep each night to help your body to repair and rebuild muscular tissue. Proper diet also plays a critical part in healing by supplying your body with the required nutrients to fuel the repair process. Listen to your body and don't hesitate to take rest days when required. Overtraining might hamper your growth and raise your chance of injury. Remember, consistency and intensity are vital, but they should never come at the price of your body's capacity to recuperate. Section 9 Nourishment for HIIT Feeding Your Exercises Nutrition plays a critical part in supporting your HIIT exercises and enhancing your outcomes. Consuming enough protein is necessary for muscle repair and development. Aim for one gram of protein per pound of body weight daily from foods, including lean meats, poultry, fish, eggs, and dairy. Carbohydrates give your body with the energy it needs to power your tough exercises. Choose complex carbs like brown rice, quinoa, oats, and sweet potatoes, which give prolonged energy release. Healthy fats are also vital for hormone synthesis and general wellness. Include sources like avocados, almonds, seeds, and olive oil in your diet. Proper hydration is vital for maximum performance and recovery. Drink lots of water throughout the day, particularly before, during, and after your exercises. Proper diet, paired with hard exercise, offers the optimum environment for muscle development and fat reduction. Embarking on your HIT adventure begins with a carefully defined strategy. Begin with a complete body workout regimen, completing each exercise for one to two sets of eight to 12 repetitions. Visit focus on complex activities like squats, deadlifts, presses, and rows. As a novice, emphasis excellent technique above lifting large weight Choose a weight that permits you to accomplish each repetition with control and without losing technique. As you develop, progressively increase the weight or resistance to continue pushing your muscles. Listen to your body and prioritize recuperation. Start with two to three workouts each week, allowing for enough recuperation between sessions as you acclimate to the severity of HIIT. You may progressively increase training frequency or volume. Mike Menser's high intensity training principles offer a time efficient and highly effective approach to building muscle losing fat and transforming your physique by embracing intensity, prioritizing recovery, and adhering to the principles outlined in this essay. You can unlock your true genetic potential. Remember, HIT is not about taking shortcuts. It's about maximizing effort and efficiency. It's about pushing your limitations, accepting pain and defying accepted training knowledge. It's about working smarter, not harder and generating extraordinary outcomes in little time. Embrace the power of HIT and begin on your road to a stronger, leaner, and more muscular you. Looking for high-quality supplements backed by Dr. Andrew Huberman himself? Check out the links in the description below and subscribe and hit the bell icon if you've learned anything new or anything of value.